When installing a Corsair water cooler, we need to make sure QFAN is disabled in the BIOS. We need to disable it to make sure the pump is running at full speed. If the pump does not run at full speed, this can not only lead to higher temperatures, but can also damage the pump itself, due to the constant change in flow. So to ensure that our pump is running at full speed, we need to make sure QFAN is disabled in the BIOS. To enter the BIOS, simply reset your PC, or turn on your PC, if you haven't done so already. Once you have done that, simply wait to be prompted by a message at the bottom of the screen. It should display a key, and saying, press this key to enter the BIOS. Once in the BIOS, go to Advanced Settings, then Monitor. Scroll down until you find Q Fan Control. Click on the selector, and select Disable. This will remove any fan control on the CPU header, thus allowing the pump to run at full speed. However, don't disable the chassis Q fan control, unless you like every single fan running at full RPM. Once you have completed that, select Save and Exit to reboot your PC. Once you are back at the desktop, check the pump speed of your CPU cooler. You can do this by downloading the software from your water cooler manufacturer. In this case, it's Corsair, so I downloaded the Corsair Link 4. The link will be in the video description. The correct pump speed should be displayed on your manufacturer's website. However, the pump speed in general should be within a small margin of change. 